Here is the most common way of creating folders and subfolders. In creating a folder in your preferred location, using keyboard, press Ctrl plus Shift plus N. While using the mouse, you right click in an open area, select new and click folder and rename it. Another way is you make use of the available ribbon. For instance, at file explorer window, in my documents location, at home tab, you click new folder. In Windows, to create a subfolder, you need to go inside the main folder first and then create it. For example, as shown here, a subfolder is created inside the My Folder by following the steps mentioned earlier. You may add more subfolders if you want. If you want to create a subfolder on the subfolder you just created, just follow the previous steps. Hierarchy of the newly created folders and subfolders are shown here. Now. In comparison with the previous steps, let's proceed to another option using a batch file. Open the notepad program. Without any content, save the notepad with the file name createfolder.bat and desktop. A batch file is script file in DOS and Microsoft Windows. Consisting of series of commands to be executed either through command line or by a double click in GUI environment. This time, create a folder where the batch file should be used. And put or drag the create folder file inside it. To write the codes of the batch file, right click, then select edit. Remember, you have a choice to write or create and save the batch file first, and put it to the desired folder and run it after. Type md which is short for make directory which also means make folder. Followed by folder 01 as the name of the folder. Another command which is the same with MD is MKDIR. To check if the codes will work, save the file. Now, double click the batch file, and the new specified folders will be created automatically. Take note that when there is a space on the same line, md command treats them as separate folder to create.
if you need to put them in one, the texts should be inside the double quotes as shown here. Another example, as mentioned, MD will treat texts with spaces as different folder name. Names of the folders are not arranged accordingly. So, to put them in order when the batch file is run, respective numbers are added as prefix. To make it clear, recently added folders are deleted and batch file is run again to create new folders in correct order. On this example, it will show subfolders being created inside a folder. Here, new lines will be used to arrange the folders and its subfolders. MD command should be applied to each line. There are many commands to create a folder in a batch file. For simplicity, MD is used in these examples. And putting weekdays before each day which are separated by backslash means that weekdays is now the upper folder. If you want to add more folders and subfolders on it, put the md commands on the next lines as shown.
four additional subfolders to be created inside a subfolder. By default, you should always put a backslash between the subfolder names. Having a predefined folder and its subfolders, it is better to have a batch file to create them at once. Thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe and click the notification bell button for updates.